guys, it's Kids Wilson here. Or sorry, we haven't been here for a long time, but today we have a very special video for you. We are going to be showing you guys how to make some paper airplanes that are really awesome. Um, a couple, um, about a year ago, I made a how to make a paper airplane video, and now we're going to test paper airplane videos and show you the more creative ideas. These paper airplanes that we made go really far, like one of them is called the Diamond Point Dart. There's much brothers that we both will show you how to make. Ready? Ready. Alright guys, so the first one I'm gonna show you, we're going to show you guys how to make is the glider dart. This is just how it's going to look like when you're finished with it. And it's very simple. This is what I'm using. I'm using a piece of yellow construction paper. You can use any kind of paper as your preference. I'm just going to use this yellow construction paper. So first you're going to unfold it hot dog style, just like this. Then it'll look just like that. Then you're going to open it and you're going to fold it with your triangles in the middle. So the triangle on each side like that. Then you're going to fold that down, just like that. So this is what you're going to be left with, like an envelope kind of type thing. And then you're going to fold that again, the triangles, just like that. And then you are going to fold it down kind of to the middle, kind of like that, and you're just going to fold it just like that, or like So basically the bottom part creates sort of like a diamond shape thing. Yes, and that's what that's going to look like. You're going to fold it in half. And this part, like as you're doing this, just make sure you have it kind of like folded really good. So I'm just going to fold it down like that. And just press down. Your favorite airplane, if you want to work great. If you want to fly really good, then you just got to make sure you create it properly. And then you're just going to fold down your wings. And that is your finished look. Let's test it out. Hey guys, I'm doing the testing of the glider dart. Let's check it out. Nice close up. You see if I zoom in a bit. It has that nice little thing. So yeah, let's test it out. Let's try it one more time. We'll sort of fail, so let's try it one more time. There we go. So if I had a measuring tape right now, I would see that. But you see, it went right there. But yeah, guys, let's get on to the next one. So yeah, let's get on to the next favorite airplane we are going to be making. Hey guys, you see here, aka part of the Kids Wilson pack. I'm going to be showing you <clears throat> how to make the the vlog. So the vlog is a very good paper airplane. I have made it myself. Now, I'm sure no one in the world needs this. I had to do it, I'm it, but I'm sure people in the world have made this. But yeah, basically, to make this, all you're gonna do is fold it like this. You're probably gonna be like, oh, it's gonna be easy. All you do is unfold it, blah, 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 blah. No, you're not gonna unfold it this time. This time, you want to fold it like this down one more time. You're going to unfold it. Then you have this piece. You want to piece you want to do. You want to fold it. By the way, there is going to, by the way, this is a two. Oh, a, a, a two. You want to that thing? Yeah. So it's. It's a transform. It's a transform paper. I'll show you how to transform. But basically, you want to pick this card up. Then you can fold that card. Then you just fold it. And then you 
hold it like this. Give yourself the other side. And then basically you have your log. It's very, very simple. I call it the log because it's the log. And it comes back. It does have a good light range. And you have to destroy it. But the way to transform it, you know how we made that little crease? Basically with that crease you want to have is you want to destroy that crease that I have. You see how I like to do that? So that crease that I have, basically what you want to do, un unfold it where it's like this. And you just have to this thing. Yeah. So you see how I unfold it like that? And then you know that crease right here? So what I do is you want to get it out again. So it creates this little type of, I don't know how to explain it, but this type of, um, this type of crease, yeah, crease. And you know what you want to do? You want to fold it. Then you want to fold it back up. And here's your other version. Here's your other version. This is actually black. I made it looks like it looks like blue, but it's actually black. But yeah, let's do the mini log. It was bad. So the mini log is more of a model type. But to transform it, you want to take it, fold this part out, so it's like that. Fold it up, and boom, you have the log. And that was a fail. So the log's more of a type of boomerang thing. So if I were to throw it, there we go. So yeah, so you just gotta throw it low, so it goes like under like that. So we're gonna do a little. So yeah, if I had a measuring tape, I would uh, see the length of it, how far it went. But yeah, guys, let's get on to the next paper airplane folding. All right, guys. This next one is just the famous class paper airplane that you see everyone making. It. It's super easy. It takes less than a minute to make, and I'm just gonna show you guys how to make this. So first, you're gonna start by hot dog folding it just like this. So it has a little crease. Well, a little crease. But yeah, it has a crease. And you're gonna unfold that just like that, and you're just gonna make your little triangles and make them nice and even. So it's on the crease. Yeah, so be like that's not even. Like you kind of want it like right there. Like that. And it's okay if it over, the um, triangles overlap, it's fine. Just like that. You're gonna fold them just like this. And then you're just gonna fold, make to make your wings, they're gonna fold it back. And like that. Let's get a closer look. This is your classic paper airplane. Super easy. It took me like 10, 20 seconds to make. Actually, it was a minute and four seconds, five seconds. Yes. But that was basically it. Yeah, that's that. So let's go into the flight test. One thing I want to say before we do the flight test here is that the classic paper airplane sometimes works. But yeah, I'm not sure the guarantee that's going to work. But yeah, let's see how good it goes. That was a fail. Go get it, go get it. Go get it. <laughs> oh, that was a fail. I'm gonna go get it. Now, I'm gonna try this out. You got that. So let's try it out. <laughs> so like I said, it was not really guaranteed to fly. <laughs> let's try this one more time. I think the wings need to be bigger. So yeah. I'm just gonna make the wings a little bit bigger, guys. Um, Bring it over here. Here, let me show them. So we yeah, we folded so we, the wigs a little bit better, like that, and so they're too short. They didn't see that. You guys, didn't it's see sort of it. like a boomerang thing. It kind of, we'll do it again. Go ahead and get it. But yeah, but um, let's just do it. The main mistake that uh, she just made is that she didn't fold the wings up. So we're gonna try it now. Go ahead. Here's where we're, let's try it now. Okay. Like I said, it's not guaranteed to fly. Actually, let's try it. It's a classic. Yeah. So remember to keep your wings up. So if the wings are down, it's not going to fly that good. So keep it up. And yeah, the fact that we're sitting down is 
hard to do it. Off so let's do it one, one more time. time. Let's do it. Wait. That was much better. As you see it went over there. Much better, don't you think? So yeah, let's get on to the next paper airplane. Bye. This next one is called the kite. This is what this kite, the kite looks like. It just looks just like this. It's fairly, very simple. Once you get the hang of it. So I'm just gonna use my balloon construction paper and let's get into it. So this one, you're gonna fold hamburger style. Usually you fold, when you make an airplane, you fold it hot dog, but this one is a little different. So you're just gonna go ahead and fold it nice and even hamburger style. Then we open it and obviously it should look like that. And you're just gonna start folding it down to get to the halfway mark, just like this. Just keep folding it like this until like you get to like, well, right here. Like until you get to right here, there. So once you have that, you are going to turn it over. You are gonna go backwards and you are gonna fold it just like that. And then you're gonna fold it halfway like that. Just like that and you're gonna fold it halfway. It sounds kind of confusing. So I'm gonna show you guys one more time. It looks like that, and that's how it turns out. But I'm gonna go through it one more time. So you have that, and so you have this right here. This is what I did. I folded it hamburger style, then I rolled it up. Because if I unroll it, it looks just like that, and I folded it um, hamburger style. So you're gonna fold it hamburger style, and then I unfolded it and I'm just going to fold it like that. Simple and easy and you get that. Then you're gonna turn it over four and a half way, just like this. Now if it's a little stubborn, what you wanna do, you wanna um, stick your finger in the middle so it'll pull it down, it makes a little round thing. Yeah. So if it's a little stubborn, so yeah. And then you're gonna fold it down, simple like that. And then you're gonna fold the wings back and you get what I like to call, well I like to call actually, the kite. Let's take a close look at it. So that's the kite guys. Let's get to the flight test. Flight test. So I'm going to be doing the flight, the kite, aka the flight, the kite that we just made. Let's see how good it flies. Fail. So you actually want to get high, so don't sit in fire. You want to get stand. Bam! It came all the way over there, right there. Let's get on to the next one, the next and last one. So let's get on with the folding paper airplanes. This one that I like to call it, it's sort of like oh, I haven't really given it a name. I like to call it the twister. Let's get to it. So basically, oh, I mean, yeah, the twister. Basically what you want to do, when you make this, basically what you want to do is you want to take this part and fold it. Now you don't have to fold in the hot dog thing if you're really neat at this part, which I am not. But yeah, it doesn't have to be that. So you just want to fold it down. Take this part and you just basically you want to fold this top part. Once you've done that, Once you have folded it like that, you just want to fold it up, fold it down, fold it down one more time, and there you have the twister, aka I like to call it the baby. Let's get into the flight test. So the reason this is called a twister is because it's meant to just do a little spin in the air. It's meant for a fancy show. So yeah, that's why it's not gonna fly that well. It's meant for a fancy showing, so yeah. It's more of a model type paper airplane, so to make it look cool. But if you really want it to fly, all you need to do is grab some scissors. I have my scissors here. What you wanna do, you see how you have that? You wanna take it and nip that bottom part. 
So you have like a little tiny thing right there. You want to fold it like that. So you, yeah, you have this. Now if you touch flight, it's still going to go the regular length. But this, like I said, is more like a model type paper airplane. But if you really, really want to fly, you're going to fold these wings down even more. So it's like that. And you see it try to fly. So let's do it one more time. I promise. Take this part right here. Fold it up. And you're going to throw it. On to the next one. Hey guys, we are back for some more. This is our last one. Yeah, the final one of every other We have tons more, but we probably don't have enough time to do it. Basically, to make this one that you have here called the Diamond Point Dark. Let's get to it. First, let's get a close-up look at it. So you see, it does look similar to the glider dart, but it is a much different uh, design type thing. So let's get to the flight test. And whoa, that went over the kitchen. Amazing. Yeah. So that's going to be about it for... That's it. For more videos like this, subscribe and please like. Thumbs up. And if you're wondering the type of construction paper that we use, it's this one. You can get it from Walmart. It is called construction paper, aka it's from the um the um basically the um the brand it's from is called Pi Pack Pack On. So yeah, if it's just, you just can't can get it from Walmart. Um, I believe it's two or one dollars, a couple of bucks. So yeah, and you can use any kind of paper. And you can do these anytime and they're super easy and even the more difficult ones are easy too it will sometimes they'll take you a while to catch on but they're super easy it's getting a little dark outside so we better end this video soon hope you enjoy don't forget to subscribe and thumbs up bye bye for more videos